The family of a woman shot and killed following an argument at a pickup basketball game came face to face with a killer in court today. Cameron Hogg was supposed to go to trial this week. Instead, at the last minute, he took a plea deal, 20 years in prison for the killing of Asia Womack. Her family angry that he won't serve more time. Fox 4's Peyton Yeager live in Dallas with the story. Peyton. Heather and Womack's mother is one of the family members who took the stand today and faced Cameron Hogg for the first time during that plea deal today. Now, just a few days ago, um, Womack's mother was expected to go to trial, but now Cameron Hogg will be transferred from the Dallas County Jail here behind me to a state prison. Inside a Dallas County courtroom on Thursday. Look at Asia. Andrea Womack wanted this poster of her daughter, 20-year-old Asia Womack, to be the final image Cameron Hogg saw before he starts his sentence in a state prison. And 20 years is a slap in my face because my child's life is worth way more than 20 years. Hogg took a plea deal of 20 years in prison, the Dallas County DA offered, for the October 2022 murder after an argument at a pickup basketball game in South Dallas turned deadly. Court documents say following the basketball game, Womack and a friend then went to watch football a short distance from the park. Police say Hogg showed up and fatally shot her. Thursday, Hogg heard from Womack's family. How can you do a friend the way you did her? She's supposed to be your friend. And you can say whatever you want to make yourself feel better. But your soul will be tormented every day of your life. Andrea Womack says she wanted to go to trial, which was set for earlier this week. On Monday, I received a text saying that he had taken a plea. I don't see any way in the world that a jury would find him guilty of murder when he's all he's doing is simply defending himself. Hogg's defense attorney, Brett Martin, claims he had multiple witnesses lined up to testify Asia Womack pulled out a firearm twice, and that's why prosecutors settled on a deal. I can tell you that the police were aware that she had a gun and was trying to pull a gun uh, the night of the offense. In fact, one of the witnesses who was going to testify in the trial, his name was Robert Walker, mm -hmm. uh, he told the police that night that both of them were reaching and he was just faster than she was. Fox 4 asked the DA's office about the defense's claims, plus any statement on how prosecutors settled on 20 years. The office responded with no comment. Now, prosecutors were pushing for 50 years in this case. The defense started at 10 years. Hogg does have an extensive criminal history, including robbery, family violence, and aggravated assault. So again, the plea deal landed on 20 years.